Hey guys, so I feel really awful and sick today, which isn't fun. I felt really awful and sick yesterday too, and I missed school, and I'm missing school again today, and I already missed school a lot, so this isn't really good. But I'm gonna go to care now, later, and hopefully they'll tell me what's wrong. I probably just have a bad cold. Uh, but then they can write me a note and then the school won't care that I was gone. Anyway, so I am wrapped up in a blanket. I have my heater going. I have some Earl Grey tea. What does my cup say? I don't even know what that is. You see that? I don't know what that means or what it is, but we have it. I actually drank hot tea for the first time yesterday and I'm really enjoying it and I think I might just like turn British from drinking tea. Yeah, but it's pretty awesome when your throat hurts a lot. So I have exciting news which is the whole reason I did this right now. Um, earlier this week, I got a phone call from the University of Mary Hardin Baylor, where if you don't live in Texas, you probably don't know what school that is. It's a private school and it's not that well known. It's not the same as Baylor but it was like, I guess the same family donated to it or something. I don't know. But anyway, um, I got a call and this guy was like, hey, am I just wanted to first of all congratulate you for getting accepted. And then he went on to this big spiel about other stuff. And I was like, I was accepted? What? That's news to me. <laughs> I didn't even know that I had finished my application. I didn't know that my school had already sent my transcript because I had sent an email but I didn't actually fill out a transcript request form. I didn't know how that whole thing worked and um, so apparently it was sent in but I was really confused because I had never gotten a letter or anything because usually colleges send letters saying hey you're accepted and yay good job um, and I didn't get one so I was really confused. So this morning, I finally called them back and said, all right, what's up? Am I actually accepted or not? And they said, yeah. They said, you were accepted based on the fact that you are in the top 10% of your school. That's all I had to do. I mean, I always thought it was a lot harder to get into colleges. And maybe that is really hard for some people, which is understandable. But for me, I've always been just a good student without really trying. I'm a perfectionist, so, I mean, it's like my life to get straight A's until recently. I don't really care as much anymore. But, yeah, so it was always kind of easy for me. And being in the top 10% was like a no-brainer. It's just been happening. So I always thought that it was going to be a lot harder to get into school, but apparently not. So I didn't know how I feel about that. I feel like it should have been harder, but I guess the hard part will be like getting scholarships and stuff because I don't got no money. <laughs> um, yeah, so I thought that was pretty cool. I'm going to try to get better. I have some exciting things to do this weekend and I need to be okay and not sick so that I can do them. So, yeah. I hope I didn't completely bore you. I feel like I said that last time, but that's life. I feel like I'm a boring person, so yeah. All right, guys, bye. Have a good day.